physical therapy and wellness and this is Ryan my husband Ryan he's also a physical therapist and we are here today to talk to you about golf and we've got this is Frankie hey buddy. Um, so could you like raise your hand or give me a golf swing if you are a golfer or if you wonder how you what you can change to make your swing better so I enjoy golfing with Ryan because I enjoy getting outside. I enjoy um, hanging out with him. <laughs> He's out of here. I enjoy reading in the cart. Usually though, after about six holes, I am tired of golfing because I've hit the ball more in those six holes than he does for an entire 18 hole round. So I'm really excited because now we know he's been um, watching my movement and watching how I move and watching my swing and giving me a few pointers because every time I hit the ball, it always goes to the right. I can hit it pretty far, but it always goes to the right. What's that called? It's a slice. It's a slice. So Ryan is going to watch me do a few movements and he's gonna talk a little bit about how those movements can affect my golf swing. Another thing that he does is you want to tell me? Uh, yeah, so... Is a golf swing analysis. Golf swing analysis. So the Titles Performance Institute puts on a course, and they teach you how to screen golfers, and they teach you how to assess their swing with a video, and we determine if there are certain movements that you are... If there are certain <laughs> movements that if you are lacking, if you're weak, if you're tight, um, we can see those movements in the screens and in your swing, and we can hopefully help correct those and make your golf game a little more enjoyable. So what do you want to do? You want me to set up? We always, we always, we always do it with a five iron. So you want me to set up like I'm going to hit a five iron? Yeah. So, uh, like I said, there's 16 screens. We're going to go through a few. Um, the most basic one is your setup posture. So I want you to face left and I want you to hold your five iron like you would. Okay. And then I want you to, so, for her setup posture, I'm looking at her low back. Um, a neutral posture would be a flat back. And some golfers, some golfers are the opposite of, so she's arching her back. What is this called? What does my spine look like? I mean, we're looking at your pelvic toe. That's supposed to your oh, pelvic toe. Oh, yeah. Looks like a C, right? Can you see it? Yeah. Yeah, we call that a C posture, and that's an S posture. It's a little more technical. And so what happens if I... I'm in a, if I'm in this C posture, if I'm in this C posture, how does that affect my swing? So a C posture is better than an S posture. Um, an S posture is worse for back pain. A C posture will limit some of your rotation. Pop your baby. <laughs> so show me, show me your normal setup posture. Okay. So it looks like she's probably in a little bit of an S posture, but to determine that, I'm going to take away this. I want you to cross your hands, and I want you to try to go into an anterior tilt and a posterior tilt so from this position. Like stick my booty out. Stick your booty out. And then, and then tuck it way under. Pop your booty and tuck. Okay. What are you looking at? So while I'm doing that, I'm looking for the quality. You're a little shaky when you go into a posterior pelvic tilt and a C posture. And it's pretty smooth when you go into an anterior pelvic tilt. And if I'm in this position, I can get a better rotation than I can yeah. if I'm in this position? So, I mean, just to show them, uh, so, so um, stick your booty out and then try to rotate, okay? And then do the opposite, flatten your back and then try to rotate. Oh, so much further. So if you're in an S posture or your anterior tilted, we would try to work on st stabilizing your pelvis or increasing your mobility so that you can rotate easier back. Okay, what else do you want to look at? Let's do one more. Okay, one more. Um, let's look at your shoulders, because a lot of people have tight shoulders. So, um, what I want to do is, you turn, so I'm just going to hold you there, and I want you to externally rotate or bring your hand back as far as it goes. Okay. Ugh. Okay, so that's one way to look at it, and then now get into your back into your golf posture, and now put your arm up and do the same thing. Oh, it's so tight. So if that's tight, 
rotate on your backswing, you externally rotate. So if that's tight, you won't be able to do a full backswing. Okay, so we looked at two different things today for golf. Here, you can't see your head. This is head. what this is what our family pictures end up being all the time too, as Ryan's head gets cut Back out. here. <laughs> okay, so we looked at two things that can have a lot to do with your golf swing. We looked at how rounded your spine is versus how popped your booty is and how much that can affect your swing. With your booty's too popped and you're in this um, S posture, it's really hard to rotate where if you have kind of a rounded spine, you can get a lot more rotation. And then we looked at your shoulder um, range of motion. How far can you get your arm back when it's up at 90 degrees? Because that has everything to do with how far you can get your arm back. So we are doing golf video swing analysis. So Ryan takes a video of your entire swing and then he does a super cool thing with colored lines and boxes. And he um, does a video description of what's going on with your swing. Are you sliding your hips side to side? Does your head move? And it all has everything to do with what kind of motion you have. So we, this video analysis is super cool. On our blog at, um, I think it's www.breathedsm.com slash blog. There's two new golf blogs up and you can see two of the videos that he's done to talk about what your golf swing looks like. And then he ties it to um, the movement analysis and there's 16 different movements that he screens. We look at how well your hips can rotate, what your spine looks like, how much shoulder range of motion we have, um, what kind of wrist range of motion we have, and can tie that to all sorts of improvements in your golf game and also to possibly injuries that are happening from golfing that way all the time. So check us out at www.breathedsm.com. I'm Libby Troush, this is Ryan Troush, and we're doing golf movement uh, screens and video analysis. Um, can't wait to see you. Thanks, bye.